here, you two. It's Dewey. And today, I'm out on the DR, as you can see. And we're going camping. So, I'm going to be going riding for the next four days and camping three nights up on the east side of Mount Hood. Got the bike all loaded down, so it kind of handles like crap. This is a kind of a squishy bike to uh, load up with a whole lot of gear. But with the new suspension, I think I got the preload dialed in finally after I stopped for gas a little bit ago. And it is doing a little bit better now. It's not nearly as wallowy, so I can actually lean it. And what I'm actually going to do here is stop in here. This is unbelievable view of Mount, of Mount Hood when it's not clouded up. Unfortunately, the mountain's a little clouded in today, but we're going camping. So you saw the picture of the motorcycle with all the bags on it, and what we're doing is just going across to the east side of Mount Hood here. the east side of Mount Hood, we are going to just set up camp and we're not going to move camp every night and I'm meeting a bunch of guys from ADV Rider and we're just going to do some trail riding and mess around on the Forest Service roads and basically have a good old time for the holiday weekend. This is actually Memorial Day, you're probably watching this, it's probably almost July or into July by the time I get this one published. But I'm out on the holiday weekend, that's when I'm going camping. So there's really not much to see, especially with the mountain clouded in, until we get a little bit farther. So the road that I need to take is damaged because of the big fires that we had. So there's supposed to be an off-road detour that is passable. So I'm gonna go try that and see what I get. One day you will see This is the detour road right here. It is actually paved. I figured that because it was a different road that it would be all dirt coming up through here. But it's not. It's nicely paved. It's narrow. There was a couple of cars coming the other way. So that got a little tight. But other than that, it's quite a little enjoyable side tour here. So, yeah, I don't think there's going to be anything too exciting along this road other than just a pretty narrow road through the woods. All right, so here we are in the morning after camping last night. Everybody's getting ready to ride. We're warming everything up. And we're going to go find some trails. We may have one bike that is a uh, battery challenged. Well, here we are on the Barlow Road. So anybody who played Oregon Trail as a kid will remember the Barlow Toll Road is an option to get to Oregon. And this rutted out piece of crap is that road. So it's quite interesting to imagine covered wagons coming through here, huh? Puts it into perspective what, the, what it was like for them. And as you would expect, I'm the slowest guy in the group, so everybody is in front of me. I'm just trying to not get lost.
Yeah, you can only imagine bringing a covered wagon down this slope with, with no real brakes. So we got that little trail ride done. So now we're uh, cruising around. I think we're heading into town to watch some lawnmower racing. <laughs> hey. I'll give it to the guy in front of me. He's on a Kawasaki Super Sherpa 250. That thing is ripping. Doing almost 80. <laughs> Things gotta be wound out. Wound out. How cool is that right there? A line of bikes going up the hill. Fantastic. Beautiful day to ride today. This is day two of camping. You can see the mountains all around us in this area. So I think next is lawnmower racing. Hey. enjoyed those lawnmower races. That was something unique and different. And now we're riding back to camp with this beautiful view of the mountain. So some of the other guys are taking a little different route back, a little more difficult trail. I'm just cruising back to camp. See Mount Jefferson off that way. That's Mount Hood. Here come the guys coming down the hill climb. Oh! <laughs> we got a group of us. We're sort of playing around, looking on some quad trails and stuff. game on this stuff is to try to space yourself out enough so you can actually see what you're riding on otherwise it's just getting dusty as you can see especially with the big KTMs up there spinning their tires that's all right we're out exploring we even still got some snow up here
yeah, now we're just, like I said, cruising around playing. We're kind of in and off of dirt and pavement. Just having fun on the third day of camping. So I had done a really poor job of getting any off the bike stuff or even much video at all. I've just been out having an absolute blast riding around with everybody. But I think I got some, so I thought this might be kind of a multi-episode, but I don't think it's going to happen that way. I have a feeling you're going to see this all in one. But what a beautiful way to spend the holiday weekend this has been. We're going to keep playing some more, so I'll probably throw this back on when we get into some more trail riding. Baby, this is do or die. Oh, that was great. I, I was, as I was rolling up to it, I had Jeff in my head, which was just roll through it. <laughs> Whew. How was that? fun well here we are it's the morning of day four I am all packed up and I'm actually heading home so I had a absolutely great time I really didn't film anywhere near as much as I planned to or thought that I would so that was a mess up on my part but I had an absolute blast. Hopefully I got enough footage to make something interesting. And if you're watching this, it means that I did. Otherwise, nobody's ever gonna see it. But I should have a great little ride back. Hopefully traffic's not too bad, being a Memorial Day. The traffic can always be a little crazy. 